placement of fans really make that big of a difference? Well, I decided to put that to the test. And with every experiment, so-called, you have to have an independent and dependent variable. So the independent variables in this experiment are going to be the temperature in my room and the apps that I run. So the temperature in the room was a constant 69 to 71 degrees Fahrenheit, and I made sure of that. So the dependent variable will be the number and placement of fans in my computer. I have six total that I can move around, and these are all Corsair Quiet Edition fans. I have two 140 millimeters and four 120 millimeters. So those are going to be moved around and tested. I'm going to be running three apps for a total of 20 minutes each, and after each app is ran, I will let the computer sit for 30 minutes so that it can cool down and just become mostly room temperature, and that's the least I let it sit for. This was this experiment will be run for multiple days. The three apps that I ran were GTA 5, Battlefield 4, and my video editing software, which is DaVinci Resolve. So I'm going to be also doing seven tests with the GPU and CPU, so it's not just one. The fan speeds are not going to be altered, so they're all just going to be set on auto. So even if there's only two fans in the computer, it might work harder, but the other ones, if there's more of them, it'll be more quiet. So in conclusion here, the fans actually made not that big of an impact. The biggest difference was a 10 degree difference, but that was from the beginning to the end, and that was with the rendering, DaVinci Resolve. And all the renders were made in 1080p regular settings. So I'm going to place the graphs now and you can see the actual temperatures for yourself but other than that here's here's the stuff. <laughs>